We'll start off, this is about how the inside home it is going to look, right? So, um, uh, so if you look at it, this typically what we say is inverterless box, if you come inside the home, you either put it on the right hand side or on the left hand side, but closer actually, okay? Because most of the time it's all one chota small one room hoga. So, you put it the inverterless there. And then you uh, do the wiring this way so that the battery along with the stand will be on the ground. Uh, then you will have a minimum distance so the inverter will connect to the battery. You take a small this thing and then provide the mobile charger here. And from here you take it along the wall there. Okay, So it will go, uh, there is one which is going to come from the solar panel. The other one will go towards the uh, fans and the lights. Okay. If you do like this, then what happens, you can very clearly estimate the cable length requirement. As long as you do like this, you exactly know how much. So what we have done is, I'll show you, it's about 5 feet from the ground. So that you can look at all the LED indications which are there. This is at about 3 feet, so that you can actually, you know, charge your mobile phones and all from there. This whole distance is about 4.5 feet from the edge of that wall. And you take this wiring along the edge of the wall so that you will provide a clamp and everything there. So if you do this, then you will have an approximate idea in terms of how much is the cables uh, which are required. The cable, our BOQ talks about what are the various cable sizes also. From the solar, you have a certain cable size. Similarly, the appliances scale here, you need a different cable size also. And uh, inside, this is how it is going to look like. So you will do that and about four or six wires will come. And it has to come out brided out so that it looks uh, good. Otherwise, it will get bunched up there. Right? So it will get provided up, and these are all the various distances, and provide it under the PVC uh, pipe actually. Um, and then, yeah, so on the top, if you look at it, one will go towards the solar panel. This is the bulb which is to the emergency. They normally need the emergency on the outside of the home. So you can actually take it outside from there. And from here it can go to the tube light and the fan. So there is three set of wire. One wire will go towards the emergency load, one for the normal load and one for the solar panel actually. So uh, and then this is a, so actually if you see the real installation, you will see the inverseless controller, you will see the braided cables, there will be a junction box here, it will go to the mobile charger and the rest of the ones will go towards the district. Right? So this if you follow this then it becomes easier uh, to estimate uh, how much is the cable length which is required. Correct.